Hey babes, welcome back to Holocraft. Uh, I believe this is episode 5 and I didn't realize that I didn't record any of my audio because I was blabbing and blabbing on and on about what I was doing here. So this is voiceover cast right now, but we did clear out a um, mansion, but I would recommend going to check out everyone else's videos because everybody kind of linked, not linked, went through the portion of us clearing that out. Um, But what I'm doing here and what I was chatting about uh, is I'm collecting all of these pumpkins because this part I filmed before Halloween, um, about a week before, and I kind of just like spur of the moment got the idea that I wanted to create a kind of game and I chose over here by spawn punched some holes in the ground and then don't worry this part is all coming after I've already cleared everything out um and I I don't know if I'll end up taking down the whole thing or not but you can see there's like blocks of diamond emerald gold raw copper um iron and then here towards the latter half of this clip you'll see me putting redstone down but i really just kind of thought of it spur of the moment of creating a like almost like a hide and seek guessing kind of halloween game to celebrate it with my holocraft members um and the way that it kind of works i ended up you'll see the stages here coming up soon but I kind of made the rules of um, for each pumpkin that you chop, you paid a diamond, but I didn't think it through all the way, um, to be completely honest, because out of the eight blocks of diamond, plus all the other goodies in here, you could have paid uh, 48 diamonds and walked away with 72, and I didn't think about that until after the fact. Um, but you know it who cares it wasn't about me making money it was more about me or making diamonds i guess it was more about me coming up with something fun for the holocraft members to do um in a fun way to celebrate halloween because it is my favorite holiday um and i go all out for it and so it only felt right to bring that kind of spirit for Halloween into um, Holocraft and I think for the majority everybody enjoyed it Um, but you'll see uh, coming up here the next couple of clips you will see um, how it transformed from just being all these jack-o'-lanterns into just you know aerial shots here of I did end up using um sea pickles for the stems you can see i changed all the ground around it to kind of be like a muddy pumpkin patch with dirt and then i added hay bales and pumpkins growing around the outside and then i'm building this big pumpkin behind where i sold halloween pies and he's got a little creeper face um and on top of his head is actually a block of um emerald But yeah, this was when I went to come back and check it a couple of days later and noticed a few people. Well, actually, one of the members uh, sent me a screenshot of their diamond that they found for their first one. Um, And I believe it was Wax. And you can see my little diamond haul here. And here you can see me starting the process of creating a path from the starter area to our mega build base area and it's a long walk um, and I had a lot of clearing out to do.
everyone. So I haven't really taken the time <laughs> this episode much to talk to you. Um, I've just been busy, busy, busy getting things, taking my time, trying to figure out how I want this path to look from main spawn base starter area to our mega base area and this is not the final form but i am trying to recreate a little pattern that i came up with and loved in my heart of core i'll obviously mix in not obviously but i will mix in our similar color palettes there kind of do things around honestly probably make some like uh, custom trees and stuff but I think I'm going to give myself the time of the whole season to extend it because as I'm talking to you, you will see like just how far away a walk this is. And since I am not using Elytra, my little cheeks got to walk this whole way the whole time. But I think I've kind of filmed this episode over the last month and... I don't know exactly what I want long term for this little um, path, but I just really want to like integrate the spaces into each other. But I did feel like one thing that I really, really, really want to do this episode, since I am not, <laughs> I've bit off way more than I could chew, tearing all of this stuff down, making sure vines weren't growing in the way, like just doing this took a really long time and I still have a little bit to go in here um but I think what was I gonna say oh I think for ending out this episode I am going to be taking my time or maybe not necessarily taking my time man I laid a lot of torches right here <laughs> unnecessarily so um, yeah, not necessarily taking my time, but the last thing that I want to do in this episode, um, before starting some build at our mega base area. And then, like I said, this path, I'll, I'll do a little bit here and there every episode, possibly show it in every episode just to finalize this because here we are still running, still galloping. I honestly should be using my horse that's been tied up for a long time over there. Um, but I think I keep cutting myself off. I talk in circles. I apologize. My main goal right now to end out this episode is to actually be clearing out the huge cave. Well, not clearing out. Maybe clearing out, lighting up at the very least. The very huge cave that is underneath our mega base area. And so you can see now we are in the dark oak forest and this path directly leads and eventually I will make a better path down right here. Um, but this is where my main focus of my portion of the build to start for the mega base area is going to be right here. Of course, I'm like housing with my husband who is red in the server and he has been busy building out this we got a little slime building out this tree but my main focus is going to be integrating a greenhouse kind of vibe i might cut this back a little bit um situation in here and then eventually we are planning to kind of do different like tree roots and stuff to other areas um just to connect other things down here um, but yeah, this is, oh, it's like, is there an enderman here? So this is kind of where we have everything right now, but as you can see, we barely touched the surface of going in there. So I do want to light a good portion of all of it up before I finish off this episode. So I will, ooh, I probably got to light up all that stuff behind me too. I'm going to be trolling around down there for a while but i am going to end up ending the episode here maybe right after this outro i'll show you a little bit of everything of clearing out some of that but that's not my main focus in this episode um but yeah otherwise i'll see you guys in the next one make sure you check out 
all the other SMP members linked always below. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next Holocraft episode. Bye!